my God. I'm so going to buy it. Yo, 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 guys. What is up? Eric Zilli here with another video of my thoughts. Now, this in particular episode of my thoughts is going to be a little short because I've just been informed on my social media, just countless of people just sending me links to this and I'm like, what is going on? You click on the link and there she is. The new Bandai Biollante figure. And holy moly, man. When I saw it, bro, I legit geeked out, bro. I'm like, oh my god, bro. Nah, but seriously, though, man, the figure legit looks impressive, bro. Honestly, when I first heard that Bandai was going to be um, releasing Biollante as a figure, I honestly thought it was going to be like a reissue of the 8-inch um, Biollante figure, the one that came in a box and stuff. I thought they were going to reissue that and stuff like that. But when I saw the picture, that was obviously not the case. Bandai is starting to pick up the game, bro. It's starting to release new sculpts of figures now. Which is really, really good. And just absolutely amazing. Um, as, as of right now, uh, we have some information. Now, unfortunately, this figure is going to be released in the end of March. Which is in two months, pretty much. This month of February and... Month in March, pretty much next month, and um, I don't know. For me, I kind of want it right now, <laughs> but you know, we I could wait honestly. But yeah, I mean, just look at this guy or not guy, this girl, man. Look at this, man. Look at that. You can rotate. It looks like you can rotate one of her vines right there. Some right there. Maybe, I mean, I hear in the back, it kind of looks like all the vines are going to be together on on her back. Like, it looks like they're going to be, like, standing out in their back. I mean, it doesn't look like they're going to have, like, their own, like, sort of thing going on. But, yeah. But, uh, yeah, man, like, this is really dope. Oh, yeah, and also, it kind of looks like her neck can move. But, honestly, though, I kind of hope it's a glucio because... Why does Biollante need to move her neck? I mean, that I mean, what what other what other reasons why she needs to move her neck? But anyway, though, just like absolutely amazing. Uh, again, I I will buy it. I will buy it. Probably do an unboxing if I get it, but I'm not sure. But the paint job looks somewhat okay. And you know, it's a new sculpt of Bi of Biollante, guys. It's freaking sick. Now the price range. Now we have gotten the price range of this guy, of this girl, and um, it's pretty reasonable. Uh, it's gonna be somewhere around the sixteen dollar to twenty dollar range. So it's not gonna be too much. It's not gonna be too much money, and it's not gonna be. It's not gonna be a little money. It's it's gonna be. It's somewhat reasonable. So, so that's that's good. That's good. And um, how tall it would be. Unfortunately, though, I've heard rumors that it's going to be around six inch, six inches. So, I mean, it's not going to size up really well with your Godzilla figures. But I've also heard, luckily, that it might be in the deluxe range. So pretty much around the seven inch to eight inch scale, which is really, really awesome. And I'm and I kind of have my fingers crossed for that. But uh, yeah, guys, um. So yeah, that's pretty much it of what we have, of or at least what what I know so far about Biollante, and you know everything else. So yeah, guys, I just wanted to give you guys a little little bit of my thoughts on the new Bandai Biollante figure, and it's freaking amazing. Um, but yeah, tell me in the comments like what you guys think of the figure. Are you gonna buy it or you're not? Or you're gonna pass it? I mean, why would you, honestly? It's a freaking Biollante figure, man. But, you know, 
Uh, but yeah, just, you know, tell me your thoughts on this. And yeah, guys, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Sign off, guys.